All right, here on the Versus screen, you can see TCM, that's Dalla Dave right there on the camera on the left side, and on Four Kings, we have them on the right side of the camera. Uh, once we get into game, that could swap around, just be aware of that. We'll point it out again as we get in. But the map is going to be Daybreak. That is a set map by our administrators, and it is loser's pick after that. We are out the gate right now. TCM, Dalla Dave, who uh, actually single-handedly basically was the only attack uh, successful attack in one of the games earlier on today. He is their leadoff attacker for that reason. They put the most trust in him for those early attack rounds and for uh, any extra round situations where he's going to be the most frequent attacker. Yeah, well, I mean, they play, he's played spectacularly. I mean, even this morning when we were considering, oh, is everyone, you know, truly warmed up? Is everyone ready to go? He's, he's looking fantastic. So we'll see what he can do now, though, as he makes his way around this L gate here on Daybreak and tries to pick up that early shot around the side, but he did catch the uh, defender out in the open now. Oh, my goodness. And comes back and picks <laughs> him off despite taking armor loss. Another oh. second shot, rapid fire, 52 meter shot there. One defender left against two armors. Whoever that defender is, it is Leavzu. He is just all alone in a, in a sea of hurt right now. If Deladev can pull the trigger on him or hop on that goal, uh, he will win the round. He's being a little bit cautious right now. I would love if he just hop on the goal and try this out, but uh, now he's down to just one armor. He does oh. land a shot as the last second ticks down. Oh my goodness, he almost gave me a heart attack. Why I did he hop on the goal? I think that's why he intentionally <laughs> did it, just to give you a heart attack. I don't attack. want a heart attack, he's Dave. He's handicapping four kings. He knows he's got this. Uh, that's, that's ridiculous. Okay. <laughs> Well, no more heart attacks, please. If, uh, if the players have any you know, control over it, I would just like to maintain my health for the rest of the day at least uh, so that we can see who wins, okay? So just be nice. Fine. Uh, Ezekiel Maybe. on the attack now for four kings. Surprised to see TCM actually not playing that L fence, playing very actually far back. Uh, I imagine the spawn, it looks like Alliance is on the low ground. I don't think I've ever seen that. He may have fallen. Yeah, I think um, he did. But oh man, and he pays for it. So uh, at least Ezekiel has already lost a point of armor. So it's a it's a pretty even situation for him. There's some time left on the clock, but he's need, gonna need to get to that goal. Yes, he is, but he's actually put himself in a decent spot. Daladev actually was pretty aggressive dropping down that early, but he timed it perfectly. So Ooh. well done there. Just Daladev now remaining as the last defender, but he picks up the last rocket shot. Very nice 2-0 advantage for TCM. Yeah, Daladev with that first very nice opening attack round and now that clutch defensive shot off to a good start for TCM. Alliance was struggling a little bit. It looks like uh, we may have a pause needed. Just go to spectator. <laughs> go yeah. to spec. <laughs> All right. Well, it looks like there's a small difficulty real quick, so he's going to figure out his mouse, and we'll get things going here in just a second. So uh, our sincerest apologies. We'll do something similar to what we did last time when Curse was up 2-0. We'll probably restart the match, make sure all of the uh, orders are right, and then jump back into it. Yeah, unfortunately, uh, it looks like we are going to have to do that. Uh, oh, whoa. whoa. Uh, no, you can't attack against one player. <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately not. Okay, there we go. <laughs> and uh, everyone left, so right. we are going to have to go ahead and yep. uh, so restart here. So that was a 2-0 in favor of TCM. Alliance was the attacker, so I think we are going to have to restart the game. Yeah. If we could get a, uh, someone help there. Let's... Uh, but yeah, so we're going to go ahead and uh, we're either going to restart the match or we're going to restart from attackers being in the right position and uh, make sure that uh, we have everyone going the right way. And it looks like, yes, they are just going to vote restart. So uh, All right. Sorry again. Uh, just s sometimes issues pop up in the middle of a game. Uh, yep. People get kicked a spe spectator every random now and, now and again. Um, but it looks like everyone is on board here. We're going to vote to restart the map with an assumed 2-0 lead for TCM. That's right. Uh, that was Daladave that had the successful attacking round for them. So far, so just keep that in mind as we continue on. Alliance uh, needs to be the first attacker here. Uh, so blue wins the toss. They'll, of course, vote appropriately. And uh, there we go. But we have a quick start for TCM already. They, they've done a nice job. Uh, really, it's been Daladev who's uh, saved the day both on offense and defense so far. So, yeah, in those uh, first two rounds that uh, TCM has taken up, that's it's been quite good for Daladev. Uh, he had a hot start earlier this morning, and his teammates Alliance and Dracius actually uh, were struggling a little bit on offense earlier, so I am curious to see, now that we're back in the game, how Alliance does. And again, uh, assumed score of 2-0 for the red team, TCM. So uh, the score might get a little bit funky later on, but we'll, we'll try our best to keep track of it. All right. Well, uh, Alliance now just skipping around towards the left-hand side. Try to catch Ezekiel. Out of Ezekiel was actually flat-footed, and uh, Alliance missed the shot, so they did not have eyes on Alliance and unfortunately did miss that uh, flat-footed standing shot. Okay, so Alliance uh, still trying to duel with the defender here at the fence. I'm not sure what he's going to be able to actually do. Uh, looks like the player has actually fallen back now to the goal anyway. Uh, Alliance 
Still not able to land that quick shot. It looks like Ezekiel hops over to try and take advantage of his laser recharging, but still gets picked off. There is a player rotated down now to the point. It's Leavesu, but he's eliminated as well. Alliance with two armor now against the remaining player, Fraskin, has a great shot here, putting TCM up even further. There it wow. is. Alliance looking for that laser earlier on, finds it now, and now the score is 0-3 to three in TCM's favor. Uh, that's right. So 0-3 now in favor of TCM. Fraskin really has to start bringing things back for four kings quickly. They're already down two attack rounds um, because TCM has been absolutely flawless so far on both attack and defense. Okay, and I'm just going to try and keep up in the chat uh, e after each round, pay super close attention because I don't want to forget and have it come up again later. So Fraskin attacking now for four kings, looking for a good way in, is already down to just one armor. This is going to be a really tall order, uh, perhaps the tallest of orders. No, well, I don't know. It was still a tall order because he didn't actually <laughs> manage to when get it's, it. When it's 8 0, zero to 4 is yes. now the score for TCM. They are off to a hot start. Yeah, when it's when it's 8 0, that may be the tallest of orders. Oh, yeah, you're right. One you're armor, right. I guess so. that's, that would be the tallest. <sighs> okay, anyway, <laughs> it was a tall order nonetheless. Uh, now, uh, Drakey is coming through, and we'll see what he can do to see if he can keep this streak alive for TCM. They are perfect on attack round so far, uh, and a perfect 4 0 so far on this map. All right, Dracius. Uh, again earlier this morning. He was taking some time to warm up. He did fine on defense, but uh, he was struggling a little bit to find his offense. Uh, after Alliance and Daladave setting the example, I'm wondering if Dracius can just like leech off of them some of this uh, laser power that's been going on here. Uh, still, oh wow, that actually, I was yeah. going to say, still a tough situation when you have to duel with someone like that, but he just swings around, takes him out very easily. Four Kings might need to be the team that wakes up here and warms up a bit. Leaves you in an open position, does get taken out. The goal is open, just one defender remaining, but just one armor for Dracius. Oh. Good job by Fraskin planting that last rocket, and that is the first point there for four kings. The score is now one to four in TCM's favor. All right, at least they staunch the bleeding bleeding a little bit here, so if they can land an attack round, they'll start to get a little bit of confidence, uh, and we'll see if anything can come of that. So just picking off rockets, though, having a good time. All right, yeah, having a good time, man. I'm telling you, there needs to be a mini game where rockets are just flying all over the place, and you get increasingly more points for the number of rockets you hit. It could, huh. be, a, it could be a mode. I like it. Yeah, someone do it. Someone in chat, someone watching the stream at home, anyone who's good with scripting, make a mode. Uh, just It could be even be like a target practice mode where you know, you're just trying to hit these rockets in play. It could be good. Training map. Well, uh, <laughs> oh. I would actually love to see. It leaves you, though, comes back with a good shot after he takes one rocket from Alliance. We still see Daladave and uh, Drake. He's oh, posted man. around the back, and he actually jumps in. Daladave had a perfect nice. position on the last two rockets, a great defensive round, and That's, it's 5-1 now. Yeah, 1-5 to five in favor of TCM. Still just updating everybody. I'm writing it down here as well, just in case. Uh, but Daladave up to attack again, and he did have a successful attack round earlier. Has already shown some good stuff on defense. TCM is a team that qualified very late in our qualifiers. Look at Whoa! that 81-meter shot. You don't see that that often. No, <laughs> no, that that was awesome is what it was. Uh, yeah. All right, so Daladave now is in a pretty decent spot. He did lose one point of oh. armor, uh, and we see four kings trying to wrap around the side oh of him. Oh, my goodness. Ooh, Daladave <laughs> narrowly missing Ezekiel. Yeah, Ezekiel looped around Daladave. Saw it coming, though, quickly got his crosshair over him. So, uh, you know, doing a good job paying attention and still uh, just barely missing that shot on Ezekiel. And now he's just biding his time. He knows that if he can keep them separated long enough for the goal to be open, he can uh, get them isolated. There's a second shot. One more laser uh, would put TCM in a very, very good position. It looks like Fraskin is the last man standing again for four kings. Next shot wins. Daladave swings and misses. Fraskin could land a laser. There it is. Daladave actually landing the laser yeah. at the end there. The score is now 6-1. to one. TCM. TCM, these guys are on a roll. I told you, Della Davis just handicapping him. He doesn't. He doesn't want to do the easy way of capturing the point. He just wants to eliminate everyone every time. So <laughs> that's easy. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so Ezekiel now, he, uh, they've got to turn around the, their fortunes very quickly. They have one defensive round to their credit, and that is it. That's their only point. Yeah, and four kings. I, I mean, I feel bad bringing it up while they're down like this, but their last game of the night last evening was a zero-nine performance against Fnatic, sending them into the lower bracket. Do you think that? That uh, performance last night might still be causing issues with them this morning, possibly. But I, I don't know. I mean, that's it's it's another day. They've had time to you know practice, regroup, and get ready again for today's performance. So I don't think it's necessarily that. I just think right now TCM is just outclassing. Well, Daladave is outclassing pretty much everyone. <laughs> yeah, and Ezekiel down to just one armor now. Great shot there, 44 meter hit on the player rotating down. A second shot, 18 meter hit. Now he's got six seconds to try and land that last laser. Great jump oh. up 
up, but Alliance on top of it, shutting him down. That's 7-1 now for TCM. All right, so pretty decent job there by Alliance to keep alive. Uh, I mean, Ezekiel... That was a sick move, though. <laughs> yeah, he did make a really good run at it, not only with the yeah. two shots, but also basically triple jumping on top of the, uh, uh, the goal point level all the way from the low ground there. It was cool stuff. Yeah, indeed. So Alliance, uh, he did actually have an attack round earlier. Good stuff from him. He's been, uh, he was slumped a little bit this morning, but he's back on top of it now. Uh, lots of lasers flying here in this match. I love the accuracy that we're seeing uh, out of both teams. Uh, you know, every single defender that you can take out is a, is a huge thing. So, uh, oh man, look at that. Alliance going for the jump on top of the fence. Doesn't quite make it, but the score is now 2-7 to seven, uh, in favor of TCM still. That's right, but uh, TCM only has to defend twice and they win. Um, four Kings actually have to land three consecutive attack rounds, basically, in that time in order to even things up. All right, Fraskin on the attack now. Still no successful attack rounds out of Four Kings this morning. Uh, we'll see if they're going to be able to pick things up here. This game might well be out of hand. It's going to be very difficult for them to come back. But, uh, you know, each of these players has gotten to this point. Uh, Four Kings was in the winner's bracket just a moment ago, really. So uh, any of these teams can easily... Uh, come back if they put the, you know, put their effort in. So yeah. it is now two to eight in favor of TCM. This is actually map point. If Dracius can get the attack round here, that's map number one in the bag. Well, he's certainly going to try. He picks off a couple of rockets as they're streaming towards him there for a while. Um, rockets actually going in all directions. I don't even understand how the last couple of these like popped up from the side. <laughs> I don't understand what angle those were fired at. But Who knows? Regardless, yeah. oh. great shot from Dracius. He only has two defenders left. Raskin actually exposed himself. Dracius was almost able to take advantage of it. Man, these TCM players, they only lost to Pyrogen earlier on in the tournament in the winner's bracket. And, uh, you know, they actually had a rough start against Imaginary earlier on, losing that first map, but they came back and took it, and now they're just looking on fire. Uh, all three attackers doing great stuff there for TCM. Even though he is down to one armor now, he may not be able to seal the deal, but he does have 15 seconds to either kill both of the final defenders or capture the goal. Not going to happen. Fraskin shutting him down there. That's three to eight now. Uh, so they, the team four kings must win out on rounds if they are to try and salvage this first game. So right. Leave Zoo, everything rests on him right now. He's got to get this attack round if they're going to continue on here on Daybreak. Okay, well, we'll see if he can do that. Uh, he's being pretty patient may not be the right word there. I don't know. A little bit uh, of trepidation as he slowly starts to make his way up to the front there, and he's not even advanced past this first set of arches. So now finally exposing himself. Daladay sitting around the capture point. I'm sorry, around the spawn. And what a great shot from Leezu. That was pretty incredible. Now he's got two defenders left standing, two armor to his name as Alliance hits him from the side. That's one armor remaining now for uh, Alliance snapping another shot on him. Three seconds left until the goal is open. I don't know what Leezu can do. He can do nothing as Alliance lands all three of those shots. That is game number one in the bag. Uh, even though this round is starting, remember we had that 0-2 little mishap. So the first game goes to TCM 3-9. to Very impressive.